What's going on everyone, this is Dom, and today we are doing a camera comparison between the brand new LG V60 and the Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra. And right now we're using the front facing camera and you can hear the different sounds and see the video coming from each respective device. And well, we're recording at a 4K resolution and I wanna know what you think about the quality in the comments section below. But right here, like I said, front facing camera on both devices. So let's jump into the rest of the tests. All right, so here we have a 4K video demo from the rear cameras on both devices. And uh, they do have the capability of recording 8K video on each device, but we're not gonna show that off in this video just because you won't be able to see the resolution, uh, just because uh, it would be pointless to crunch it down to 4K. But you can see here, this is a video demo, a pretty bright environment. As you can see, I'm walking, just trying to get uh, an idea for how the stabilization works, but let me know what you think about the video quality here in the comments section. All right, so here we are recording with the ultra wide lenses on both of the devices. And I think it's important because a lot of people might use this for vlogging or something like that. But I wanna know your thoughts on the video quality here and the stabilization. As you can see, I'm walking a little bit, just kind of strolling down this alley because, you know, quarantine content. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section. All right, so now we're gonna be jumping into camera comparisons and we're gonna be checking out the high end of things first with 64 megapixels on the LG V60 and we have 108 megapixels on the Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra. So essentially with these high resolution photos here, I mean, it's really hard to determine what's what and which one is better just by looking at them. So be sure to check the gallery link below if you wanna see the full sized images for yourself. All right, so here we are inside of my car, front facing video again, 4K, and we are testing out the rear camera at the default settings. And that is going to be 16 megapixels pinned on the LG V60 and 12 megapixels pinned on the Samsung Galaxy S20 Ultra. So let's get into that. So as far as these photos go, a lot of them are very similar. I mean, in color accuracy and exposure and focus, like they did a really good job. But I noticed too that the V60 sometimes struggles with blowing out highlights. And you can see that in various photos here where sometimes things are just a little more blown out than the S20 Ultra. But at the end of the day, I think they both take pretty damn good pictures. And like I said, there's a gallery link below with all these photos in them if you wanna check them out for yourself. One thing I will say is that the V60 does not have any optical zoom. It does a two times digital zoom. So, I mean, obviously we gotta give the win to the Galaxy S20 Ultra just because it does have some pretty crazy optical zoom capabilities. All right, so here we are indoors and we are going to be taking a look at some low light shots in here and some night shots from the V60 and the Galaxy S20 Ultra. And I will be sure to link a gallery filled with all of the photos taken from this comparison in the description below. So be sure to check that out. So in case you were curious, here is some like low, low, low light out in the dark at night footage from the front facing cameras on both of these devices. Looks pretty grainy on the screen. I don't know. What do you think? Here is also some low light 4K video and I'm just walking again, testing the stabilization, seeing if it uh, makes a difference in low light or not. But you can see here the image quality between both of these cameras in a very, very low light situation. So here we have night shot photos. And I have to say, I gotta give the win to the V60 on a lot of these. Maybe not all the time for clarity, but definitely for color temperature. The S20 Ultra just looks like it has an orange filter on top of a lot of the photos here, but the S20 Ultra does perform significantly better in very, very, very dark situations. So kind of a toss up, but I do prefer the colors on the V60. All right, so here we are indoors using the ultra wide lenses on the V60 and the Galaxy S20 Ultra. I wanted to give kind of a low light test uh, as far as the ultra wide lenses go. And we're recording video here, 4K resolution. So I, I don't know, this pretty much wraps up this camera comparison. I wanna know what you think about all of these situations down in the comments section below. And if you enjoyed this comparison, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. And if you're new around here, subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit the notification bell and select all notifications so that you can see every video when it drops in the near future. So let me know your thoughts. Thank you so much for watching everyone. I really do appreciate it. Once again, this is Dom and I will catch you in the next video.